Hi guys, this is Uncle Rory, and this is Papa. Papa is uh, one of my best friends. Papa came to me quite by accident. Papa was a feral cat, and he used to travel the neighborhood, and uh, he was kind of a terror around the females, if you know what I mean. Well, I asked around, and he wasn't owned, per se, by anybody, so I uh, went ahead and captured him, and I had him neutered. I kept him for about four days, and when the antibiotics that he was supposed to take had run out, I just opened the door, and I figured if he wanted to come back, that's fine, but at least he wasn't going to terrorize the neighborhood and uh, have any more unwanted little cats around. So, about two weeks, three weeks later, I hadn't seen him, but about five o'clock one morning, I felt him jump in bed with me. And I reached down to pet him, and it was all bloody. This one arm, his right arm, you can see he doesn't have a toe here. He lost his toe. It was scraped off, like in, uh, if he was dragged. I think he got hit by a car. And this arm here, it was broken like a twig and hanging like that. Well, I called my vet, Jamie Velasco, over here in Burbank. And Jamie said that he would meet me at the office in a few minutes. He did. And uh, went in. And when I got him out of surgery, about five hours later, he had his two arms straight out in front of him in casts. And he had one of those funnel-type plastic or nylon shields around his neck. He couldn't eat. He couldn't drink. So from that point on, for about the next uh, month, Every time he wanted to eat or drink something, I came, I fed him, he drank out of a cup or out of a small saucer that would fit inside of the small cone that was around his neck. And obviously, you can see, he's turned out to be one heck of a guy and a great friend of mine. And no longer is he feral, but he is one of the most dedicated and loving cats I've ever met. Anyway, for all you cat lovers out here, this is Uncle Rory. Papa and I say, bye-bye. Boy, yeah.